Okay, this is just a little thing that kind of a pet peeve of mine. This hose here, doing the oil change, Sidewinder. This hose here runs from here to here. And obviously, being that I've been kind of in the plumbing trade for a long, long, long time, uh, I'm a contractor, but I do a lot of plumbing. And uh, you can see <laughs> that there's no way that that oil is going to drain out of there. So if you go by the book and you do what they tell you to do, you're still going to have quite a bit of oil in this tube. And um, again, the reason I'm able to do this so easily is because I've removed the side panel. So I highly recommend this. I think it's a smart thing. Remove that panel, drill out the rivets, and then I'm going to install rib nuts. So every time I do my oil change, I can do it right. So... Uh, I haven't drained this yet, so let's see how much comes out. I'm assuming this whole thing is full of oil. Well, there you go. I mean, there's probably a half a cup, three quarters of a cup of oil in there. So, you know, every time you do an oil change, there's a lot of oil that's never coming out of these engines. And it's really nothing to do with the engine. It's not a Yamaha thing. It's a stupid Articat thing where they put these... I mean, I don't understand that. I guess they're... You know, they have to have an oil return line, but you would think that they could design something that just was a little more common sense. So, um... So we don't have to friggin not get all the oil out of our uh, machines. <laughs> 